Hello, everyone. Welcome to more Political Excess. I don't do a lot of political commentary on this channel, but there's been a lot of news about Disney and Florida lately. I figured I'd talk a little bit about hypocrisy. And it does seem like it's kind of funny to see the Democrats running to defend a corporation because that corporation aligns with its social philosophy. And the Republicans would be guilty of this too. The Republicans would gladly take a corporation that aligns with their social philosophy. It's just that most corporations these days are aligning with the democratic philosophy, the social justice philosophy, that direction. So I do think that if you agree with the outcome, if you agree, for example, stripping Disney of its special privileges, whether that actually goes into effect or not, if you agree with that, the motivations on how you got to that conclusion should be irrelevant. If you thought before they shouldn't have it, then fine, leave it at that. You shouldn't all of a sudden want to defend it because you think your opposition has ulterior motives. That, to me, doesn't make any sense. You saw a lot of this, you see it all the time in politics, but you saw a lot of it when Trump was in office. A lot of times people would just frantically take whatever position Trump doesn't have because they despise a lot about him and they don't want to agree with anything, even if they already would have agreed previously. You see it a little bit with Biden and Republicans doing it. It's more pronounced, though, I think, with issues on the left. I think that the hypocrisy is more glaring, in my opinion, and it gets tolerated more. But I don't really care if that... I don't know why you can't just say, hey, that you like or don't like Biden or Trump, but you agree with two or three things. What, what's wrong with that? No one says if you like or if you vote for somebody that you agree with every possible position that they have anyway that doesn't make any sense to me and in this disney case you know it was traditionally democrats who are you know against mega corporations and things related to that and in this case when the social philosophy aligns with them they're rushing to defend it that's just pretty glaring if you're in the middle or obviously if you're on the right you're going to see that and think, okay, there's no substance here. It's all about what suits you in the moment, that kind of thing. So that that's just a little bit of what I got to say. You see that even outside of politics, just in life in general. A lot of hypocrisy. People don't want to like someone if they dislike certain things about them. I don't get that. I don't know why you can't separate the two out and like someone or not like something, but also agree or disagree with them about more nuanced and specific issues makes no sense to me but this big florida thing just reignited it for me anyway I, there's a lot more you could say about it i'll leave it at that for now if you have any thoughts about this please like share subscribe or leave a comment down below thanks for watching got some more redistricting coming up stay tuned